So it looks like we're getting one of those rare peeks into Darius Crooks actually telling some truths about how he is a internet influencer who is able to continue his wrath of predatory practices and scamming and sociopathic behavior. And in this recent uh, clip that I grabbed, Darius finally admits some of this publicly. And he has a warning for any of you who may choose to attempt to speak truth to his predatory practices. And for everybody else who's on the outside looking in, uh, feeling like you, um, I don't know, want to go up against me, want to challenge me, don't, don't. I don't have anything to lose, right? And he tells you right there that one of the reasons you would never want to come against him and speak any truths about uh, being wrongfully treated or scammed or expose any of his negative predatory behavior towards you he's letting you know that he has nothing to lose which basically means he's morally bankrupt but let's continue once your name is trashed on an, a national level you know forbes and black enterprise that's it what else can you do you've done it all and he also goes on to finally admit that his brand and his name is really officially trash at a national level which means that he's fully aware that he's been relegated to scamming his same dhags repeatedly because the mass public definitely has the common sense and critical thinking skills that it takes to know a scammer from the fruits that they bear or the lack thereof in this case so I have nothing to lose and the world to gain. And he also confirms what I've said and many others have, that all he cares about is worldly gains and not his followers or having a good heart or being a person that is purpose driven for leaving this world better than he found it. He's letting us know that he only uses the Christianity and Baptist Church Act to indoctrinate his blind following of DHAGs to get their hard earned money by overcharging them for the cheap goods he gets from the alibaba.com website where he marks up those products 200 to 400 percent above his cost so i'm at a really great advantage point so i'm just saying like you gotta be very careful when you do that kind of out here on the internet and it doesn't go away man and he admits that he's aware that his actions on the internet have not gone away meaning the documented proof of his decades plus of scamming and predatory practices that continues to present day is receding all over these internet streets and of course i'll continue to share those with you so definitely hit that follow button like the actions you're doing in that somebody screen recording that somebody watching that you know and he is very correct there is always someone screen recording and watching to continue to expose this horrible internet predator 